morning guys welcome to life with lena and if you guys are new here please click that red subscribe button down below and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up As you guys can see I am back home I just did a face mask on my face so if my face is a little red that is why I just took it off about 20 minutes ago at this point I did like one of those super detoxifying face masks it's the um, Amazonian Indian healing clay I will link it down below you guys know I use it all of the time and I did it with coconut vinegar I am looking at my uh, to-do list for the day we have like a super long to-do list if you guys there you go there's like my super long to-do list and I don't even know what I'm making today for my lunches for the week. I have no idea. And I still have to go get my nails done because I started like picking at it yesterday because it's just so grown out. So grown out that I started like, oh my god, why aren't you focusing? Oh, come on. Focus on my nails. There we go. So it's so grown out if you guys can see on these other fingers that I started picking at it. So I need to go get my nails done, but I'm not going to get uh, gel nails anymore. I just, it takes too long and then it takes forever to get them off. So I'm just going to get them off today and probably get like a regular color painted on them. And then throughout the week, it's pretty easy to just paint my nails like quickly. Or if I wanted to just have no nail polish, that's fine too. But um, I do need to go and get the gel kind of polish off. So I'm not going to pick all of them off. <laughs> just, I just like started. I was helping out. We do also have so much work to do today. We have so much baking to do. I don't even know what I'm making for lunch. Like I just said, I know I'm making hummus and cutting up some celery, which I need to make a grocery list because I don't even have celery anymore. Sorry guys, it's so dark. It's so dark because it's so gloomy outside. So it's like so dark everywhere else. I really don't know what I'm making. I have have no idea I was trying to look up like a crock pot thing that I can make so that I could still work on stuff while dinner or lunches are cooking rather but I just um, I got nothing so far I still still gotta use this brain right now and try to figure that out I made some more unicorn uh, cupcake toppers. Oh, I also filled out a fax form. I have to fax this to Verizon. It's supposed to get me my discount on my monthly plan, 19% off, because I now have my teacher ID, so I have to take care of that stuff too, but I don't have a fax machine, so we're probably gonna go stop by Staples and try to fax that. Oh shoot, it's raining. I gotta check, make sure all the windows are closed. Um, okay, so we'll close that window. I need to get a little ready. I don't know, I just, I, I look fine, kind of, but at the same time, like, I need to do something like with my hair, clean up a little bit of the black under my eyes from like all the eyeliner and stuff yesterday, but then we're gonna go also to the nail salon because I need to go get my nails done finally. I wanna get my toesies done too like quickly because my toesies are just, the nail polish is uh, getting old, but they're definitely not as bad as my sister's toesies were as I saw and I scraped my foot here. I guess the other day or something. I'm tired of like getting the gel. Like every time I've been getting the gel for some reason, they'll put the gel on and then I put it under the UV and it burns my nails. I don't know why and that definitely doesn't sound good or sound healthy at all when my nails are legit burning when I put them under the UV. So no more gel. We're done with that. <laughs> so I was standing here brushing my hair. I had to brush out everything because I had like braids and it was just so knotty. My hair gets really knotty in general and I don't know why and I keep getting it cut. So it's not so knotty because I felt like it was split ends at first, but I don't even have split ends anymore. So I don't know what's happening with my hair, but I'm just, you know, brushing my hair. And then I don't know if you guys could see in that corner up there. But there's like a giant spider, I think, or like a bug. And leave it up to me to like legit find all of the bugs in the house. And I have to take care of that because I don't want that crawling in my mouth when I sleep one day. Nuh-uh. So we got a fly swatcher. Swat what is this called? A 
Swatter, 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 fly swatter. Oh my god, this is just creeping me out. Oh my god, I have to go up there and kill this thing. I don't know if I can even reach it. It is so big. It's such a big spider. Not really sure if I could reach that or at least swat it. It's like in such a weird um, angle, but I'm gonna try. And then if anything, I'm gonna scream when it falls. Oh my god. Squishy, squishy. Oh. It's still alive. Ah! It fell! It like fell and I saw the like legs still moving as I had like the swatter thingy on it. Oh, so disgusting, so disgustingly gross. It's just, why do spiders even exist? I don't even understand. We just should not have spiders at all. No spiders, no stink bugs in this world, no other creepy crawlies like um, those, what are they called, the silverfish? Those are so creepy too. Why do we have so many creepy things in this world? My hair looks pretty nice though, you guys see this? Look at it, ready? I'm gonna swish it around. Look how voluptuous that looks. Look at that. That looks so beautiful, guys. It's like still curly, a little bit wavy from uh, yesterday. A little bit poofier because I brushed it, but I love that there's still like waves in my hair and everything, so. It's looking pretty good. I'm going to go get my nails done now. Hopefully this will be a quick process. I called them to see if they were busy like half an hour ago and they told me to come in at 12. So, well, my car's sounding like a whale. Sounds like a whale. Oh my God, okay. Anyway, I am going to the nail salon. I waited for my employee to get in because I had some stuff I needed to reteach her or talk about just to make sure like certain things are a certain way. Um, so that's all good. I finally took care of that because I had a day off today. Normally I don't see her on weekends, so I had a day off, so that was really good. And other times if I ever need to, like during the week, I just ask her to change the hours to like a nighter time, like so I would be home around four-ish, or not even four-ish, I don't get home that early, but around five, so if she's there till like six, I could be there like five or something. Um, so it's always different, but I just, if I ever have anything serious to talk to her about, like as far as how I want things, I would do that. So here is the color that I chose. I don't even remember what it's called, but I know it was Essie. I always like seem to get like an Essie polish. The same color is on my toesies. I just went with something that I felt was fall-like, but still kind of summer-like. I felt like purple is still summery, but by having like a purple gray, I feel like it's more fall. I don't know, but I wanted a darker color because I always have like an issue on my toes where I have like these white spots. I don't know if it's from nail polish or what, but I thought it was like a vitamin deficiency, but I started taking vitamins and stuff and it never went away. So I think it's just from nail polish, um, to be honest. I don't think it's a vitamin deficiency anymore, but um, so that's why I always get like a darker color, especially on my toes or something that's very opaque. I will never get like a nude light pinky color on my toes. On my fingers, it's fine, but I don't like light colors anyway i like something very opaque i mean I, I don't mind light colors like white but it has to be opaque so guys i tried faxing but it kept saying busy on the other end so that um is not working right now i'm gonna make my grocery list though andre is he had like a short day today so he started a little later and had a short day he's already back home and it's 2 30 and he's on long island he has an event to go to at seven with his dad but i was thinking i have to go there anyway because i need coconut yogurt from fairway for my breakfast totally forgot to get it this weekend hey guys i packed or not packed i prepared my outfits for the week i'm not sure about this red skirt yet I mean, I like it, but I need that shirt that I left at Andre's house that I wore this weekend. I also decided to get rid of three different things. I was trying that on, trying it on like a while. I was trying to figure out my clothes and I just, I wasn't liking it. So never gonna wear it. And now I think I'm ready to go to Andre's house. It's crazy. I still haven't eaten anything. It's 3.35 and I so I got Andre. We already went to the grocery store quickly and I picked up some food, for like Mexican food. I got a quesadilla and guac and chips, and because I'm so hungry, I haven't eaten anything all day like I told you guys. All these groceries are done and everything, and now I can sit down and enjoy my food. Okay guys, I'm back home. Kuba is so excited to see me. Me and Andre watched a movie. We didn't finish it yet though. It was a really long movie. We had like a little less than two hours, like maybe like an hour and a half to watch this movie, and we didn't even get to finish it, and I have like eight minutes left, and I 
feel like I need to finish watching this movie now because I don't know what happens. Andre said he's seen it before, but me, I have not. So I'm going, logging back onto Netflix now that I'm home and I'm just gonna quickly um, finish watching it because I need to know how it ends. It's this movie called I Love You Man. This one right here, if my camera could focus. This is what I need to finish watching. Literally like eight minutes, see? 8.53. Okay, so I really only had like a minute and a half left. little guy is like cuddled up on my bed I'm sorry boo there's like keys and stuff everywhere but you just look so cute oh my gosh I love you are you sweating you look like you're sweating but I think you're just wet because it was raining outside and when you went out so far I finished making my potatoes and I prepped all of my breakfast so I'm just doing a uh, yogurt with like my ranola and strawberries and raspberries so here are my four containers of that I'm also testing out this thing um, I think it's for berries and stuff like smaller berries not for strawberries but since I used up half of the thing and put them in here I had uh, room for strawberries and then basically it's like supposed to like I don't know only the right amount of air is supposed to come in here and it doesn't touch the bottom so any liquid isn't gonna like make it like go bad or anything I will let you guys know how that works my potatoes are ready also um, I'm also making some sujong gua, which is just ginger, cinnamon, um, sugar kind of tea. And we're making some chicken right now. Also got my four meals for the week, but um, I don't know if this is really going to fill me up. There were supposed to be some veggies in that, so maybe I'll make some veggies tomorrow and add it to the other three meals. But for tomorrow, I don't have any more time. It's already 10.30, and I really just need to be in bed already, so... We'll have to uh, take care of the veggies tomorrow, but I did buy some broccoli and cauliflower, so I just have to steam it tomorrow and then just add it in, and then in, and then it's pretty simple from there. So I'm gonna leave the dishes for tomorrow. How are we doing here, huh? Are you ready to go to sleep? You've been ready, mister. You've been ready. Where are you hiding? Oh, I feel like he's camera shy. He turns his head away a lot of the time when the camera's on, right? Okay guys, so I will see you tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this weekend of vlogs because it was actually more fun than my day-to-day -day teaching vlogs, I think so at least. But I hope you guys like both of them because that's, that's my life and I can't do anything about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please click that red subscribe button down below if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys tomorrow in tomorrow's next daily vlog. Bye!